Today I'm going to show you our 24 girls taste of freedom. Now I let these chicks out yesterday. This is where I had the roosters in previous videos in this run. It was all overgrown like it is in that corner. The roosters brought it down to nothing. After a couple of months, this was all barren, just like over here. It's starting to grow back. For the last week, I've been taking the older chickens, letting them run around in here, bringing it back down, and letting them get used to these young chicks without letting them out. Yesterday, I let a few of the young chicks out just to see what would happen, and there wasn't any issue. So today, I have to thoroughly clean this coop out. We're going to let all 24 of these girls out, and I hope they're all girls. That's what we pay for. Not sure what we got. So Johnny's going to open it up, let them out, and let's see how they react. Okay, come on, girls. Cheek, 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 cheek. And there's the fluttering. The trick is going to be to get them all back in. <laughs> there they go. That's why you couldn't eat the ice out here, sir. See all that dust? Yep. Okay. Go get that red container. I have their food in there. And just put a little food on the ground. Now in here, there were quite a few spider eggs the other day. I picked up some uh, buckets that were here. And they were full of spiders. And I'm sure there's ticks in here. And these little guys are going right, right to it. There they go. I'm not sure the age of them. I have to check when I bought them. They were a week old when I picked them up. And I believe they're six to seven weeks right now. And they're growing really nice. They're all getting along. Pecking order, you don't see too much of it. I don't know what to expect of them when they're at this age. And this coop is way too small for them. I have to get another coop ready for them. The large coop that I have the big girls in, that's a little tight for all of them. So I have to do another coop. Now ah, we still have one in there. Oh, we have two of them in there. So anyway, I'm going to open this door up. I'm going to pull that tray out, open this door up, scrape this all out, clean it up thoroughly, and clean it up for them. Johnny's going to watch these girls. We're going to leave them out for a while while I do the cleanup. Johnny gets the easy part. He's the chicken herder, and I'm the uh, pooper scooper. Yeah, look at them go. Now, I know there's ticks in here. Definitely spiders in here. And these little guys look like they're doing the job. Oh, the other one finally came out. There they go. Okay, no, no. Okay, yeah, push that over there so they don't go back there. You don't want to have to go back there to get them. Yeah, just like that's fine. All right. So they have this whole run to play around in today. We're trying to get these girls used to coming to us. So when we start free ranging, and we don't have to go chasing them down. John, did you get that bucket with the food? Yeah. Yeah, some food. Yeah. Put some food in your hand. Call them over. Okay. See if they come. Split it up. Put a little bit in the other hand. Let them see that you have. Uh, go next to them and put a little on the ground. Just put a little on the ground. Otherwise, they're not going to come to you. They'll just stay there. And eat. Now it looks like they're happy with the uh, fresh food. Okay, just put that in their container, John. Well, that's a wrap for now. I have to get to this coop, clean it out. I have a few other chores to do today. So while these guys are feasting out here, I'll be cleaning. Until next time, stay safe, everyone.